You got the Boston trucker here. I'm at Blackburn Energy in Amesbury, Massachusetts. We're checking out the Relgen system with Andrew Amigo. How you doing, Andrew? Very well, thanks. Can you tell us a little about your Relgen system here? Sure, so uh, we're a hybrid charging system for track tractor trailers and also for box trucks for lift gates. Uh, it's a hybrid charging system. We, uh, we use the drive shaft for uh, the power takeoff uh, spot. We actually just replace your stock center bearing with the custom unit that we've invented, so it bolts right in, no changes to the powertrain at all. And then what we're able to do is take the rotation of the drive shaft. It's been a really high efficiency alternator. Uh, this unit's 200 amps. That's dedicated to your auxiliary batteries. We can charge your auxiliary, auxiliary batteries faster than anything on the market. Uh, if you opt for our, our, our hybrid kinetic energy recovery system, we'd add our, our data in uh, electronics box and that listens to the truck's computer. So every time you step on the brake, we'd cycle the system on, make clean energy, store it in the batteries. And on these trucks, this is our, uh, our tractor, you, we run a, a Bergstrom electrified uh, air conditioning unit so that you can stay cool all night long on clean energy that we make during the day while you drive. So it seems like it really makes the driver's life a lot easier and more pleasant on the road. Yes, and that's that's really the focus of what we're trying to do is, yes, we're trying to save the, the fleet fuel and, and save the emissions, but we're trying to do it in a way where the driver is the focus of what we're doing. So instead of having pulling in with your electrified air conditioner and only having 70% charge in the batteries and the AC quits in the middle of the night, and then you want to run the engine, but the fleet is yelling at you for idling at night, we actually will get you 100% charge in those batteries. We'll do it faster than anything on the market. We'll do it more fuel efficient than anything on the market. And then that'll keep you cool all night long. Uh, in fact, we can even do extra things for you. We can add extra batteries. We can run a CPAP machine to make sure that's fully charged all night long and running for you and not cutting out in the middle of the night. Air conditioners, um, refrigerators, microwaves, crock pots, whatever it is lift you want to run. Lift gates. Yeah. Uh, we can run your lift gates so you're not getting stuck on the side of the road all the time. Uh, we can do all of these things. We're doing them now for a number of customers. We've been in the market for about two years. Uh, and, you know, interest is starting to grow and things are starting to turn for us. So uh, we're just trying to get the word out to folks that we have something that may make your life a little better. And so it doesn't burn any diesel fuel, so it just runs pretty much off the trucks. Correct. Yeah. Runs all electric, so it's nice and quiet. Uh, when the unit's on, it doesn't. you don't have that diesel smell and that diesel right. sound all night long. So the you're technically not right. en idling, like where a lot of states have those idling laws. You're not idling. Correct. This actually qualifies for tax credits. Uh, it qualifies under the smart way. Uh, so all those things are available. You do comply 100% with the no idle laws, mm -hmm. but you still remain comfortable at night. And that's really, the, at the end of the day, we're trying to be driver focused in everything that we do. So for us, if the driver is happy, then we've been successful. And uh, so far, the reaction of drivers has been pretty pretty good. They really like it. They like that the batteries are full and that the systems perform better. And you're not running one of those giant bulky generators that are hanging off the truck, getting covered in ice, and you got to get them maintained on the road. And they're always breaking on the drivers. This is correct. This is a pretty simple uh, system here. Yep. The, the maintenance on this is very very low. You really don't have any moving parts. When you have a fan spinning on the, the compressor unit. But unlike the diesels, the diesel engine is another diesel you have to maintain. Not only do you have the oil changes, but those things rust out pretty mm -hmm. quickly. Uh, these units are designed to be essentially maintenance free. You're going to check your battery connections at your regular PM. Yep. Uh, but other than that, you're, you're running a maintenance free unit that should give you years of, uh, of good service without the headaches of the diesel, without the smell and the noise of the diesel. And, uh, and again, you're going to comply with all the laws everywhere in the country, even California. Uh, wow. California loves them too, and uh, you get weight gives back at the, at the scales, so you qualify sure. for all those uh, uh, exemptions, and then you get your tax credits and all that stuff on top of it. So and they must weigh a lot less than those, it those does. big bulky generators. It does. Those diesels weigh, weigh a fair amount. Uh, the heavy These units are only a few pounds. The heaviest part is the batteries, yep. uh, but again, you get a four to 500 pound give back at the scales. So for a lot of guys, it actually gives you an extra 200 pounds of carrying capacity. Uh, not that that for most folks is the biggest deal, but they are lighter than the diesels. For sure. For sure. It's, it's a demo, you know. All right. So here's a, here's your battery bank. Um, we recommend the the better AGM batteries for uh, faster charge, deeper di cycle discharge. So these are the Odyssey Extremes. Uh, in this box, you're going to see a few extras. So what we can do for folks is add a, a marine switch that allows you to isolate these batteries from your starter batteries. Uh, but in the event you ever had an issue where you couldn't start your truck, 
you can actually turn this switch and start your truck on these batteries. So we can configure this in different ways for you. Uh, some people like them isolated, some people like them in parallel with the starters. You can go either way. This unit is also configured to power your Stinger. So if you actually do run lift gates on your tractor, we have a number of tractors that, that run the Stinger uh, connection. So your, your Stinger now is not running on your starter batteries, you're running back here. And then this is our electronics box. And then these units can be mounted anywhere on the back, high or low. If you run a headache rack, we can go up top to get out of the way of the headache rack. Uh, so whatever you'd like. And then our unit is kind of hard to see. We have the back cover off for it. Uh, it's in there. You can just barely see it uh, hanging on the side of the frame. Uh, all covered in stainless covers, zinc plated, powder coated for corrosion. And uh, that unit's been on this truck for two years and, uh, you know, two problem for years. And wow. a bunch of folks running down the road like that. It's pretty impressive. You want to show us the inside and how sure. it starts up? Yeah, definitely. Well, I've spent some time in one of these before, you know. Yeah. I know you too much time. Yeah, many, many years, more than more than me for sure. So this is our little home away from home. Uh, half the unit was on the outside wall. The other half of your unit will put underneath the sleeper bunk. We can put it in any compartment. We located this one right in the middle, just for ease of uh, of showing people. So that's the other part of the unit. The ductwork comes into your regular vents, so you don't have to change any vents in the back of mm -hmm. your cab. And then the unit itself just turns on. You have a small little power button right here. Turn it on, set your temperature, wherever you want it to be, and she'll fire right up and start blowing cold. She'll blow cold right out of your factory vents all night long. Oh, that's nice, and no engine starting up, it just comes out automatically. Yep, automatic, nice and quiet, nice cold air, and that'll run you all night long with the full set oh, of that's batteries. That's beautiful, love that. Yeah, so it's designed to be a nice, comfortable environment in here. No noise, no diesel running. No vibration in the cab. No the fumes. Running, no fumes. Nice and quiet, nice cold air. So it's great for the truck driver's health and the environment. That's right. Seems like a win-win situation to me. Yeah, that's right. It is. And again, if you needed to run a CPAP machine, we can make sure you're fully charged on your CPAP. You want to run a TV. You want to FaceTime with your family at night. Wow. You want to plug in and run that stuff without having to run the engine. We mm. can do all that for you. And that's what we're really about, is helping out the driver to have a better life on the road, right. a little more comfortable, and at the same time, save some fuel, save some sure. maintenance, and clean up the environment at the same time. And you grew up in the trucking industry, too, so you know a little about it? I do. I grew up in and around it, you know, different parts of it. I've worked for a bunch of different companies. Uh, like a lot of folks, my family drove, father, brother, cousins, uncles. Grew up banging around it, did a bunch of different things, and I and I have a sense of you know I, I've been out there enough to know it's tough, and uh, and anything that can help you out is is a welcome change. So that's our approach to saving the environment is to save the driver first, and along the way save some fuel. Well, I want to thanks for meeting up with me, Andrew. I appreciate the tour, and I learned a lot. Absolutely. Well, thanks for coming out. We really appreciate it, and uh, like I said, we, any any kind of support we can give to the drivers is something we're really looking to do. Fantastic. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you. Bye now. Bye.